everybody, Brad here from Stolbeck Machinery. You know, it'll never cease to amaze me, the amazing questions that we're getting. I'm just here, it's Sunday, I'm hanging out with our favorite sanding robot, Cosmo, right there. Um, and so, today's question, so good. What can't Cosmo do? So I thought I'd take a minute and run you through a bunch of stuff that Cosmo really is not gonna do for you. Uh, we get into a lot of this crazy stuff too at Best Damn Doors, and unfortunately, it's back to uh, sometimes the good old palm sander, which which we this is like faux pas. We don't even like talking about that, or you know, some block sanders. So, uh, first and foremost, tiny parts, little drawer fronts with little skinny edges. Um, you could put this on the robot and sand the the styles and rails, but honestly. By the time you get it on the robot and push start and do all that stuff, um, you could probably have it sanded by hand. So what we do is we cycle all of the small components by hand while the robot is sanding the bigger components. And it is very, very rare that we get through your average door order and there's small parts left over. We always get them done in the same amount of time as it's taking to sand the bigger doors. So um, small parts with little tiny panels, probably not ideal. Uh, what else do we got? You know, we get anything that is not symmetrical. So Cosmo's designed to sand squares. And so the pattern that it's gonna sand is in a square. So if you've got any clipped corners or anything funny going on, probably got to do that one by hand too. Um, something like that. This is probably just a little too flimsy. Um, and in this case, there's even a step down and it's, it would just, it's just like trying to sand it. If you want to really get your head around the capabilities, just imagine you're holding a palm sander and you're trying to sand something, but you have to go all the way across it. So any time where the paper's gonna get caught on, on the edge of something or, or it's, it's brittle, probably not the best application for Cosmo. Here's another one. This one might be tough to see. Anything where the panel, there we go, is not flat. So you can see this panel has a raised diamond shape, so it's it's lower here than it is here. Um, so we're not, you know, there's no compensating for any of that. Like Cosmo's coming in and uh, he's sanding everything flat. So anything with a detailed panel like that, also a no-go. And maybe even a door like this, you, you could, if you turned off the rail style um, portion, um, then it would it would read this and then down to the panel and it would sand the panel, no problem. But one, there's it's not equipped with a sander that's gonna do a good job of, of this part of the door. And this part is so thin that if you come down on that with a palm sander, you're probably just gonna sand through. So it, it, again, it's too fragile, it's not worth it. I would just probably do this door by hand. If I had a big order um, and there was lots of big doors with the panel that needed sanded, also the back, it'll sand the back fine. Probably I would just do this part by hand and, and send out the panels and stuff on the robot. But to sand th all three levels, it's not gonna do it. Um, the other last but not least is doors that look like that. Anything that's double panel, we're not coming um, all the way across with the laser and picking up any mid rails. So again, that part, it's on the drawing board and it, it's equipped to do it. We just haven't written the program to do it yet. So there's a good chance probably um, our 2023 model will we'll have it and then we'll just send the upgrade out to everybody no problem but currently as it stands we're not picking up any mid rails and generally speaking with the sanding envelope of 24 by 48 you're not going to get a lot of split panels inside of that sanding envelope anyway uh even this door is probably too big yeah so they're probably 
going to be too big, so why bother? Um, you're, you're sanding all the really big stuff by hand anyway. So anything with a split panel, unfortunately, is a no-go for Cosmo. I uh, can't think of anything else off the top to answer that question, but I hope that that gives you a better understanding of how Cosmo works and some of the limitations. Thanks for the great questions, everybody. Keep them coming, and I'll keep making these videos.